guys and welcome to a festive themed episode of Tasha Tuesday. I love Christmas and as some of you may know I am obsessed with movies and Christmas is the perfect time of year to gather all the festive ones, all the Christmas themed ones and just watch them. I managed to find enough so I can watch one from the 1st of December all the way to the 25th and this will be my advent calendar for this year. So today I thought it'd be fun to go through a few of my favourite Christmas movies so that you can get an idea of what to watch this time of year as well. Note, they're not in any particular order. The first one we have here is... Miracle on 34th Street. For those of you who haven't seen this movie, it follows the true Santa Claus who comes to New York to see if the true meaning of Christmas has been lost. I love this movie, my mum loves this movie, every time we watch it we cry. It is just so amazing. There is, I believe, a remake that is in colour as well, but I, I think the original is just perfect standalone, so I would definitely recommend this one for anyone who loves classic Christmas films. The next movies that I always watch around Christmas time is the Santa Claus series, which has three movies in total and it follows Scott Calvin on his journey um, to becoming Santa Claus and throughout the three movies he has to overcome different obstacles in order to stay Santa Claus. So in number one he is turning into Santa Claus. And in number two, ooh, in number two, he has to find Mrs. Claus in order to say Santa Claus. And in number three, he has to verse Jack Frost, who also wants to be Santa Claus so he can have a holiday of his own. These two movies are a family favourite in my house and they are watched every year. In fact, I think we also watch them in July, you know, oh, Christmas in July. So we watch them around then as well because they're just so good. So the next movie is A Christmas Carol and there are so many different versions of this movie that each year I like to watch a different one. So this year I chose A Muppet Christmas Carol because I thought it would give a little bit of humour to the holiday. So for those of you who don't know, um, A Christmas Carol follows along Scrooge who is a nasty old grump at Christmas and doesn't like it, is very mean and horrible and he's visited by three ghosts past, the present and the future in order for him to gain the Christmas spirit. In the Muppet version you have some characters played by real life people and some played by Muppets such as Kermit Frog and Miss Piggy. What else do I have in my Christmas stocking this year? It would be the live action version of the Dr. Zeus's Grinch. I love this story and it's not the best movie in the world but I grew up with this and it brings back nostalgia every time I watch it so it's always on my list to watch either this one or the cartoon version. Another Christmas classic that I watch every year is It's a Wonderful Life and again this is another movie that makes me cry every time I watch it. For those of you who haven't seen it, it's about a man who goes to commit suicide on Christmas Eve when an angel comes down and shows him what life would have been like if he never existed. Ah uh, yes, we couldn't have a Christmas countdown without my favourite movie, Nightmare Before Christmas. No, it is not just a Halloween movie, it has Christmas in the title, therefore you can watch it two times a year and any other time in between because it is literally the best movie that ever existed. For those of you who haven't seen this amazing Tim Burton classic, it follows the story of Jack Skellington trying to discover himself by looking after Christmas instead of Halloween. And the last movie that I watch every year is I'll Be Home for Christmas. My mum and I watched it on TV one year and we liked it so much that we kind of just watched it every year it came on TV, but one year it just didn't so we decided to go out and by the DVD, so here it is, I'll be home for Christmas. For those of you who haven't seen it, it follows the story of Jake, a college student trying to get home for the holidays. However, he comes across a lot of challenges on his way home, making it extremely difficult for him to get there in time for Christmas Eve dinner. So there you go guys, that is a list of festive movies that myself and my family watch every year for us to get into the Christmas spirit. Give the video a big thumbs up if you have seen at least one of the films I mentioned in today's video, and if you're new here, why not go click that red subscribe button as I post videos every Tuesday. I hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and I will see you all next week. Bye!